Hi, Mrs. Airbag. Papa, please don't put a spell on me. Oh my gosh! How are you doing today? I'm afraid not very well. Ralphie buried Mr. Airbag's new hubcaps in the backyard. Mr. Airbag's not going to be too pleased about that, I can assure you. Maybe I can help you dig them up, Mrs. Airbag. Oh, Putt Putt, that would be wonderful. Great! Now all I have to do is find a shovel, and I'll be back. Thank you so much, Putt Putt. Thanks for offering to help, Putt Putt. That Ralphie can sometimes be a scamp. Yeah, but he's awfully cute. I just realized the dog looks like um, one of the dogs from Cartoon Network. Who? Courage. Is it Courage? Courage, or like the pink? cowardly dog. Like the He's eyes. Pink, yeah. The eyes plus the yeah. The snout. Yeah. Ugh. Mark, mark, mark. I've, this yeah, is I've, I've realized this dog and Cleo from Clifford have forever shaped my perception of what poodles are like. Yeah. Poodles hey, let's go into her yard. I'll need a shovel before I can dig up Mrs. Airbag's backyard. We can, we can <laughs> try it. There's no, there's no context for that because we talked over the dialogue. It's just like, I want to dig up her backyard. She's like, okay. So on the off chance that I didn't edit out the dialogue we had talking over it, basically Ralphie buried some hubcaps in the backyard and we've agreed to help her out, even though it's like, Papa, you're on a time limit. We gotta enter the race today, and we still have all this stuff to get. Poor He's like, Putt -Putt. No, it's okay. I can help out everyone and make it to the race in time. Which is actually uh, true. Let's go up. This is airbag. It looks kind of weird from that perspective. Yeah, she does. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> oh, no. That shed is on fire. What should I do? It's probably fine. Just Absolutely <laughs> nothing. Let's <laughs> just, let, just it, let, let it burn. burn. <laughs> oh well, someone else will <laughs> do something about it. <laughs> I've got oh, more important the bottle, things though. to do. See, here's the thing, guys. Wow. Remember this: recycling's very important. <laughs> Putting out fires now. <laughs> Putting out fires now. This is why we have a fire department. Smokey Please. said, "I'll be here in case there's a need for a fire." You know. <laughs> All right, let's go. I honk. It's my turn. Okay. Whatever, we'll, we'll go. Can we chuck the batteries at the next person and try to go through there? Seriously. What was that I ran over? It's well, nothing. It's fine. It's fine. We definitely fine. didn't run over anything or anyone. Just keep going. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you ran over a baby beast. Oh, this turned into a very different story. <laughs> it's Torvin. What? Hey, can I have wow. your flashlight, please? Thank you. Yeah. I didn't say you could. Oh! I just realized that's an accordion next to him. What I did you that think was, that I was? thought that was his lunchbox. <laughs> I never Summer squash. So you've never seen any of no. these? A salad is a treat. Any time at all, just get ahead of lettuce all round and in a ball. Break apart the leaves so fresh and good for you. The lettuce that they grow is the best. I think it's true. <laughs> At least it was short. <laughs> yeah, they're all they're all the same Wait, length. Click on the cow. Uh oh, that wasn't you. There we go. <laughs> I need a good... Hang on, we need the rutabaga song. My peas will grow. Nope. <laughs> I have a row of cabbage. What? <laughs> I have a little song about. Nope. <laughs> Come on. If you want to grow a big and strong. Come on. What can be a chip? Oh. This is why we can skip. Rutabagas are so tasty, pull them from the ground. Their flavor is so wonderful, I'd eat them by the pound. Cook them in a pot, or fry them in a pan. Rutabagas are so tasty, get them while you can. <laughs> so, I've been singing that context, song. <laughs> Artie one day came and like saw me eating lunch, and we were just like, I love the rutabagas. So I'm like, what are you singing? <laughs> and then finally he was like, Popo enters the race. There's a Dude. great song on right. I've never heard where I can All right, find we gotta do this as fast as possible, so... Okay, Pop Pop, this is what you're gonna do. Pop Pop, you're gonna drive over the rock <laughs> so we can get, so we can get Pop the Pop tomatoes. Pop the race. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> context. When I was... I was signing up for orientation for high school, and one of my friends was like, Oh yeah, like, 
where the school is located, it's kind of like hard to get to. There's like a weird like turn off point, and if you miss it, you can't get in. So she hey, found tomatoes. this place. There's like two rocks and grass. And she was like, I'm going to risk it and try and not drive over the rocks to get to school. Oh boy, this is not going to She didn't well. hit she didn't hit them, but I'm like, why did you do that? Why not turn back out? She's like, I have to turn left. Turn left to go, go right. right. Yes. See, you just There's know the where, corn. Just drive just over the dirt. All the it's fine. Corn. And you don't know where all the corn is. You know where all the fruit is. Yeah, because I just played this. I mean, I guess, but even I wouldn't remember that. I remember where, like, the cauliflower is, because that sucks. That's surprising, because the cauliflower is in an incredibly out-of-the-way place. That's why I remember it, because I was like, every time I played this, it'd be like, you need cauliflower. I'm like, no, I don't. No, I'm not getting that. Corn. It's like, I need to one the cauliflower. No, nope. next basket. See, here's the thing. I Puppet should just it. drive over the dirt, because... And then nobody would ever be allowed in Torval's farm again. He's like, you know what? Screw you people. You're just picking the stuff for free. You're not then paying Mr. me. Then Mr. Baldini can actually pay to have... <laughs> There's two ways to get produce. Grow it yourself or bribe or... a grower. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, maybe Baldini just bribed this guy like a ton of money. He's just like, hey, how about they give you like 500 coins and everybody can take your stuff for free? It's like, okay, that's enough for to last me the rest of my life. <laughs> or maybe he just loves growing produce so much. I mean, there's a he's got a big old garden farm. farm a garden farm. farm? It's called just a farm. <laughs> I was like, wait. I thought there were flowers that you could pick, but why would you have edible flowers in this game? I- okay, um... What? Okay, thank you, Mouse, for not moving. Uh, I remember... <laughs> this could be weird. Memories I have of playing this game are on Sunday before we were going to church. I'm like, oh, I've got to hurry up to the farm game before we have to go to church. <laughs> really? Yeah. I don't remember playing it before church. It's a hook. Oh. That's a dangerous thing to have in the road. I better pick it up. I guess we didn't run over baby Jake. Good uh, for us. Or maybe that's what remains of baby Jake. <laughs> a hook? We crushed him into a hook. That doesn't happen. Dangerous. I'd better call for help. Nah. I love how he just <laughs> smiles. Papa's just staring at it like, what a pretty fire. Basically <laughs> <laughs> from owls. <laughs> what the Papa's just staring at it like. I can't believe it hasn't burnt more. See, I wish this is what I wish they had done. Because this fire doesn't go out, by the way. But it won't burn out either. I wish that it would be like if you left it, it'd be like, here's an important lesson on why you should like take out fire, like because this is a kid's game. So it's just like, no, nope, it burns forever. It burns forever. I've got to do something about that burning shed. I can't put that fire out by myself. Pet, go fetch a Shine bottle. your flashlight at it. Flashlight. I put Throw the produce at it. <laughs> Tomatoes are a lot of water, right? I was more like, pet, go get a, bo a bucket Cat? of water. <laughs> Uh, no. The car count 500. <laughs> the cow count starts right now for the biggest <laughs> race of the year. Five, four, fire. three, two, one. Red Man Rick, you grab your official gear and motor down to the speedway. We've got this banjo <laughs> song in the background. <laughs> it's like, it's like this really dramatic, like, see, fire's heavy, just like, bam, 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 <laughs> but it's a terrible citizen. I think you can literally beat this without putting out the fire as well. <laughs> no, you can't, unfortunately. You can't? No. That what would does, be hilarious. What does... One of the cre one of the credit sequences is just a shed burned to the ground, Smokey, like... <laughs> no, wait, but what do, you, what do you have to do for Smokey in order to get the thing? You gotta put it out. <laughs> no, but like... Hey, Dad. Hey, I think I have something that belongs to you. We need to talk to this guy. Nope. Is it How yours? Is it ever? <laughs> but, but, you are a great pal. And Why don't you hook it back on me? <laughs> how, about, how the heck did you know that? It's almost like you've done this before. This is actually, it takes place a year after my solo let's play. No, it doesn't. <laughs> it's like a parallel but, universe. But, okay, stand back. I've got work to do. Yeah. Also, by the way, dude, why didn't you have, like, a backup hook? Why is he, he just sitting here and not also, looking around? How did, how did he lose his hook? Was he like, oh, I guess I better go to the produce thing, because I also took a help-wanted job from Mr. Baldini, and he just, like, lost it. 
And also, he can't, he physically can't fit for the also, tunnel. He yeah. must have taken it off and chucked it at also, in like, the tunnel. It's then a set hook. the shed on fire. Also, it's a hook. Wouldn't, like, somebody drive over and then it's just like, psh, like, your, your wheels disintegrate? What? Ooh. What? what? <laughs> I'm so glad we what just is, sat here. What is this nothing. Jurassic Park where they're like lowering the, the cow? cow. <laughs> that That's was... the same car. Oh my gosh. Pete Crane was in Jurassic Park, people. Oh my gosh. Good luck at the Cartown 500. That was when I stopped but watching but Jurassic Park was when they great. lowered the cow. Thanks, Pete. It's going to be fun. Hey, Pete, are you going to enter the Cartown 500 race? Yeah. I'd love to, but I can't, putt putt. That extra high-powered, high-octane gasoline makes me backfire something fierce. Ah, oh, GP, wow. that's too bad. Wow. Okay, then. Well, how about that? You know, Putt-Putt, I like working at construction. I like lifting heavy things, and I'm good at it, too. You sure are, It's almost Pete. like you were made for it. Wow. Like I said, no, I had this so kind of thought where it's like, Putt-Putt right now is just yeah. like a normal well, car. But does okay. that mean he has like no right. special key? What do you get when you cross a cow and a pogo stick? Um, got the. Uh, I almost lapsy. A milkshake! I knew that! I knew that! I knew that. <laughs> okay, <laughs> and back to the important question I had is it like, do cars like morph? Like, is it like when you're having like Fire Emblem and you give them a second seal and it's like, congratulations, you're now like, uh, um, Paladin? And then, like, all of a sudden, Putt-Putt can become, like, a bulldozer, and he's just like, Phew! Or is it like, no, Putt-Putt will forever no. be an ordinary car. <laughs> yes, that. But in school, in his school, everyone, like, it wasn't like, oh, Putt-Putt goes to school with the bulldozer named I Billy. I think he's just going to, like, I think schools are still segregated. <laughs> what? <laughs> you can't go to bulldozer school if you're a normal car. Exactly. You have to go to the normal car school. <laughs> Because they teach you to be a bulldozer. Only, only Chevrolets go here. <laughs> Are you a Toyota? You gotta go to the next town. You gotta over. go. <laughs> they don't even have that many schools in Car Town. Car Town's small. <laughs> Anyhow, they need nailers. We gotta go and nail some nails. Oh, yeah. Betsy Bulldozer, I am disappointed in you. Hi, She's like, I'm bulldozer? sorry. Hey, but but I noticed this empty bottle just sitting here on the ground. Would you mind if I picked it up and took it to the recycling center? Are you kidding? Go on and take it. Great, that is right. I was just gonna leave it on the ground and do nothing about it, because I have zero care for the environment. <laughs> no, that's the thing. If you asked an adult that in this day and age, you'd be like, yeah, sure, kid, go to the recycling plant. Okay, I, I, I've learned in my last playthrough that she's basically responsible for all the littering. Almost all of it. Like, in the credit sequence, it's her, like, burying a bunch of cups in the ground. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's terrible. Excuse me, Betsy Bulldozer. I was wondering if I could borrow your shovel. I need to help Mrs. Airbag, and it would sure come in handy. Ah, oh, you know I'd like to, but I got a heap of work ahead of me today. Only time I ever take a break is to suck down a big old fat milkshake. Of course, I forgot it today, so I'll be missing my break. I have a great idea, Betsy. If I bring you a milkshake, then you could take a milkshake break, and maybe wow. then I could borrow your shovel. But I'm liking it. You're on, and make sure it's a really big one. Okay. <laughs> This is, like, this is like my computer science teacher. If he comes in without his coffee, it's gonna be okay, well, like a bad that, that's day. That's different though, because coffee's a no, drug. No, but like I'm saying, different. like you know how it's like, oh, here's the different coffee sizes. Like here's the little, here's the venti, here's like the bladder buster size. <laughs> and like, here's the... who, oh my lord, who could ever drink that yeah. much? <laughs> yeah, he would get like the one that's like the that tall, busters. that tall from like. No one can see how places. tall you're okay, indicating. It's like like the size of Betsy Bulldozer herself. <laughs> no. Um It's like the size of a weird drum that you would play um but not that wide. You know those drums that you play in the parade where they're like Oh yeah. Those and then you make it a little thinner. That's, <laughs> That's the a coffee. Great coffee. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, well she wants a milkshake, a really big one, so let's go to Sonic. <laughs> Sonic. I've never driving. gone to Sonic. I've heard their shakes are good also, and everything else is good. What mad. is with the flour? The bags of flour just hanging out. Those are sacks of potatoes. Oh, we'll see more of those when we play Papa Joins the Circus. Oh, Papa Joins the Circus. You know, you should really stop holding, lugging that cow. <laughs> that was a weird spot for the game to lag. 
All right. Oh, this is the artsy part of town. We've got abstract the futuristic art part of town. On here. You've got a rocket. You've got the word science. You've art. got like the tire You've place. You've got the literal tire. Like, and then here's, here's my place here's filled Uncle. with garbage. <laughs> Whatever is garbage. Mr. Crank hut. Case. <laughs> Uncle <laughs> Owen's garbage hut. Yeah, that was, that's the one. What? Hi, Rover. Hey, Putt Putt. Stop littering. Dude, come on. That wasn't him. That was the other person who parked there. Jumbo milkshake, please, Rover. Best and biggest in Whoa. Cardone, Putt Putt. Coming right up. Those are some fat cars, I just realized. <laughs> yeah, they're hanging out the milkshake. Hey, no, because look at Putt Putt in the. Hey, and let's assume what that this is the same you? size parking kidding? space oh, as, like, you. a parking I mean, space you would find in a grocery store. Back from the booth. Those are some fat cars! They're, like, hanging over the lines. <laughs> Feed the cars and what you get? Fat cars! <laughs> They're, it's like, all... Do they just, I like, not click? Gee, Rover, that's really nice. I don't Matthew know what was like nice. Oh, wait. I didn't have to click because it was still playing the cutscene, but I could move my mouse around for some reason. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was interesting. Rover's just the coolest car in town. He's got like the crane. He's not really a car. He's like he's a, a moon he's rover. A machine. I hope I can find Pete Crane's hook. He I've sure never is seen sad astronauts. without it. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Did you hear that? No. I clicked up up and he's like, I sure hope I can find Pete Crane's hook. He seems so sad about it. I was like, we already did. <laughs> Pop out, have you been taking too many happy pills? <laughs> oh, boy. No, I was. what I was going to say was I've never actually seen astronauts use a moon rover. Obviously, I don't really watch people on the Do moon. astronauts even use moon rovers? What do they, what I thought, they do? I thought the rovers were like, we sent we sent one to Mars. Like sent a... Oh, no. like the, or that's the Mars rover. Oh, yeah, because then Candace Flynn was spotted on there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that. I'm glad that's how you know the, about the Mars rover. Is no, because there was the guy that's like, I can't! Stop! Yeah, I know, what? I know. And we'll get the tire patch kit. Oh, that's a shame it's closed. Well, I guess... Pop Pop, what we're just for? steal stuff from the store here's while what, nobody's here's there. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take one of our bottles that we can't recycle and just break open. It's closed. <laughs> just break open the thing, get the tires, and we're good. Let's get some money. Question: Was the fire thing in the other path? path? No, it's oh. only in this one. Well, we're gonna Hi, see Mr. if we can do it. Well, bust my bump if it isn't. You have bad. to. No, you look at all the yes, stuff. you do, Marty. What does? What do you I get so. for doing this? Sure the ladder. There's a lot of it. Yeah. For the health, Isn't it great? The safety helmet. Yeah. Um, uh, should we put this back together or just? Nah, uh, screw you. <laughs> you can Pop keep. A terrible you person can keep your garbage. Papa is such a blur between like he's such a good person. He's helping out everyone and like Papa just left a shack to burn to the ground without <laughs> doing anything about it. Oh, left well. Chuck for dead. <laughs> <laughs> Chuck's like, I really hope somebody drives by here so I can get them to help out. Ha! Huh? It's a guy, Chuck looks like he's in trouble. Drives off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're the worst. 